art gallery, Dennis Reagan would bring in participants and they were given the um, sort of goal of reviewing the art. That wasn't actually what they were there for. They de Dennis Reagan didn't tell them, but they said, you know, review the art. This is, this is what the study's about. And in the study, a fellow participant or who the participant thought was a fellow participant would come in. This participant was actually Dennis Reagan's assistant helping them out. And in the study, essentially what um, Dennis Reagan would do is in some variants of the study, this participant would go out, buy a Coca-Cola from the vending machine and bring two back and say, oh, do you want one as well? Like, do you want uh, a, a Coca-Cola? I just had one spare. And in other var variants, this sort of assistant of Dennis Reagan, who was who's pretending to be a, a participant, would go out and just buy a Coke for themselves. And then after the study was finished, the assistant would say, hey, by the way, I'm selling raffle tickets for my local charity. How many tickets would you want to buy? And what they discovered was when the um, person had given them a Coca-Cola, basically done a little act of kindness, a bit of reciprocity, they sold two times as many raffle tickets um, as when they hadn't given any reciprocity.